what's up all you wonderful ghoulies cj here welcome back to my channel um this is going to be a very short and impromptu video and as the title suggests i am going to be unboxing my new tablet so my sister is streaming overwatch i don't know if you can see that my mom is watching forensic files at an extremely high volume so if you hear a bunch of or maybe a few of square words or i don't know dramatic music from the tv that's what's going on in the back oh my hand is in the way sorry so um yeah let's get this unboxing done Hold on, let me, like center that yeah if, if you hear my sister like fussing and swear words in the back that's that's why all right guys i'm gonna try to do this as best i can with like one hand opening the box and one hand holding the camera oh my god I almost got all my stuff off of this <laughs> wait 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 bitch I'm so nervous wait <laughs> all right as you can see I had to like stop the video for a little bit because I was like knocking stuff off my desk but here's the box it is a uh, Huey on canvas gt 156 hd v2 um it's a pin tablet display oh come on Stop being stupid, CJ. All right. So this is the tablet. It's what it looks like. Um, hold on, if I can pick it up. So it's about the same size as the screen of my computer. My computer is like 15 inches. It's like 15 point something inches, which is good because I need it as big as I can. But the bigger tablets cost more money, and I don't tablet type of money so yeah um comes with a stand i thought it was gonna be like some plasticky thing but it's actual metal and it's heavy i'm going to gently place it right here um what else is in there that's like stuff stand for the manual um i think this is the pin wait a minute what else the pin right well hold on so i think this is the pin I think this is an extra pin. It says gift on it. So maybe it's like an extra pin. Oh, 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 it came with one. I was like, oh, I got to order one. I forgot one. But it comes with one. It comes with the little finger sleeve thing. So it doesn't like smear up your screen and um, make sure like tablet read your fingers instead of the pin. That sounds weird. But um, there's that. Um guess that's the I guess that's like a cleaning pad and I thought it was a CD but it's just like a circular paper oh it's the manual for the actual tablet here are some wires it's like a charging thing I guess um, oh it's like a AC adapter little thing Oh, oh, it goes on there. Okay. Yeah, this, this video is kind of, ugh, but there's another wire, and oh, it, oh, it comes with a, like a cord splitter thing, cord splitter thing, yeah, and I think this is, I think this box is empty, let me just check, hold on. Yeah, so nothing was in the bottom of the box, I'm keeping this box, y'all, look at that, it's like, shit, y'all, I'm keeping it, anyway. So this is everything that came in, the wires, the, 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 oh, it's running, okay. There's the manual, wire, pin, and I guess extra pin, finger sleeve, I'm so happy about that. Oh, what does that sound? Pin, manual for the stand, get, 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 get it out of the way, stand itself, and of course the tablet. So what I'm going to do now is download drivers and actually set up and I will be back to show y'all how it looks 
all set up and turned on. Yeah. Three hours later. Guys, as you can see, I got wires and stuff everywhere. But the tablet is set up. It worked. I had a little bit of trouble um, like getting the pin pressure to work. But as you can see, it works now. I kind of like doing this one-handed. Again, sorry if you hear like a bunch of noise in the background. My mom is watching Star Trek. Again, at an incredibly high volume. I might actually go join her here in a little bit. But yeah. Um, so yeah, here's the pin. It came with a, like the little sleeve and it is actually a pretty decent size so I'm pretty happy about that I might do um, a more in-depth like video on this later but I just wanted to show y'all guys this I'm like super excited to like work with this what am I doing why am I putting like polka dots everywhere stop but yeah <laughs> that's the tablet and um yeah three days later so I've had this pen display for about a week and maybe two, three days. I must say the only thing I don't like about it is actually I can't really find anything I don't like about this tablet. Um, the only thing that I could, I guess I could be nitpicky about is it could be a little bit bigger but again that's not really the tablet that's just me being able to afford those big old suckers so I settled for this but actually I am pretty happy with my purchase I pretty much like the way it's structured um, how it was made the even the stand even though it's just like um, a little metal fold up piece like it's very sturdy like it doesn't feel like my tablet's gonna like fly off or anything it doesn't feel like the stand itself is gonna like fall apart or fold in on itself the screen while it's made out of glass it's it has like a weird like matte finish to it like it doesn't feel too rough against your hand but it doesn't feel completely smooth which I think is good because it feels like you're um writing on an actual surface versus just I don't know writing on glass and it's like slipping and sliding everywhere again I actually think I looked up with this tablet it was listed on Amazon yeah I got it from Amazon it was listed on Amazon for $2.79 which personally I think is a pretty good price for a tablet this size Again, my laptop screen is 15 inches, 15.2 inches, something like that. And I think the size of the tablet width-wise is 15.9. So it's like a wee bit longer than my laptop screen. I wanted a bigger one, but they were just too expensive. So I scoured all through the back shelves of Amazon, if you will, and I found this. Um, one thing I will say about this pen tablet display, what have you, uh, well, maybe not to it itself, but the installation of the drivers, oh my god, it was kind of a whew, an ordeal. Um, the manual that actually comes with um, the display is just like a basic overview. They have one online, but it's not very clear on how to troubleshoot certain things. In my case, the pin pressure didn't register properly. It blipped off and on the actual um, display itself. I had to like uninstall and reinstall the driver. Yeah, the only thing I could say to that is have like a better, I don't know, troubleshooting area and maybe a what to expect um, type part of the manual. Like I'm almost 90% sure like the stuff that was happening, it was probably something I did, but at the same time, I don't know because I just don't know. So I'm, gonna say, I'm saying as like, to the people who manufacture these things because these displays these tablets have been on the market for like years now I'm like 
if anyone should know the ins and outs of these um, art tools would be the manufacturers. Just, just like give us some a quick rundown of like what to expect and what not to expect. That's all I'm asking. Other than that, um, it feels like I'm already getting used to using this display. Like, um, I got it specifically for the function of doing line work. Like, me doing line work on like a, I had like an um, Wacom Intuos. And doing line work on that was just, for me anyway, was just near to impossible. But as you can see in this picture that I'm making now, like, even though it was like very rough, it was super easier to make like a line work and like it just helps the process of me making artwork go way much quicker. So I'm already loving that. Alrighty ghoulies, that about does it for my impressions on my new Hueyon, Hueyon, I don't know if I'm saying it right, pin display. I gotta get used to saying that as well. Um, let me know what you think in the comment sections. Is this tablet worth that money? Or do you have a tablet that's better? Do you think this tablet is trash? Or do you think it was more bang for your buck? Or whatever, just let me know down in the comment section. Alright ghoulies, I will see you all on that final frontier. Bye bye!